Hey guys, I hope you all having a wonderful day. And so the TTS for Year 4 Season 4 has just been released yesterday. And we have found some interesting little Easter eggs in there. Some little details that probably should not be in there. So we have some information about the loadout coming for the Year 5 season one operators alongside information that we already know in the past so first let's talk about where they're gonna come from so we know that they're gonna come from greece because within the harry trailer with the big poster there is a map right and australia denmark india and greece were in a list right and australia we went there for burnt horizon denmark we went there for phantom site india we've got shifting tides right and then greece which has not been ticked off the list yet so it seems like that year five season one operators are going to be from greece so if we do get a new map i'm hoping it's from greece as well but we do know that the operators themselves are going to be greece greek i should say but will be from greece and then and then obviously we had the leak from Komora saying about the abilities she said something about a kool-aid man so we kind of put together that because in the kool-aid uh, commercials kind of run through a wall i believe so we're speculating that the attacker is going to be able to run through soft walls or barricades maybe and then as of for the defender kamara said something about a medical drone and a kimbo but i feel like it's more going to be medical drone so that is going to be interesting now as of for the loader which is new piece of information that was discovered within the tts so when you open up alpha packs and you get a skin right it says who this skin is available for and within some of the skins it now says like a little icon saying year five season one to say it's available for them too now we have discovered that the attacker will have the option for the arx 200 that nomad has so it comes up with the icon for nomads arx and the g36c that ash has so year five season one attacker will have access to these two primary weapons and then as of for the uh, secondaries we have the mk1 9 millimeter pistol that uh, buck and frost have so that's going to be the loadout for the attackers which we know so far as of for the defenders we have the mp5 that doc and rook have which is going to be interesting because medical drone and then having the same weapons as doc like both healers having the same weapons that's going to be interesting unless a medical drone is on attack i have no idea um spaz 12 shotgun that valkyrie has interesting and then as of for the sidearms we have the usp 40 that mirror and jackal have as their secondaries and then the bailiff which are maestro and alibi have so let me know what do you guys think we have the g36c the arx 200 as a primary weapon, a primary weapon i meant to say for attack and then the mp5 and spaz 12 shotgun for defenders I know there are a lot of lovers for the MP5. Looks like that is being reused. I know there are a lot of people who say they want new weapons. Me, if it's a good weapon, I personally don't mind. If it's bad, and then it's not the best news to get. So, yep. So, just kind of summarize everything. We got attackers, defenders coming from Greece. Year 5 Season 1 will just be located in Greece, I guess. Uh, the loadout has been leaked, which I have just read out. And then, did I mention anything else? Oh, yeah, their abilities, medical drone, and being able to run through walls. And that is pretty much all the information we have so far as of for the Year 5 Season 1 operators. Let me know what do you think of them in the comments down below blow and i hope you'll have a wonderful day and goodbye i'll tell you what for now please call me harry <laughs>